Okay, again, this was filmed on uh, February 4th, 2017, um, from about 12.19 to about 1.52 p.m. Um, I put the tide chart there so you could see what the tides were on this particular day at Bayport, and this is where I was at, was at Bayport. Um, so again, um, you know, I'm offering my proof, my explanation, my opinion. Um, and I do put these out to hear what, you know, other people's opinions are and what they think of what I'm showing in my observations. I can't see these boats with my naked eye, that's for sure. Figures the wind would have to pick up. how that boat's in the water and he's he's not on plane he's sunk in this plane a boat that's on plane he's way up above the water okay i slowed that little part down so you could see when it went by that other boat how that other boat was sunk down into that mirror hidden uh the lower end of that boat was hidden and you can watch some of these birds too they do some strange
some of these objects that you even see farther back are other boats, but you can barely make them out because of the distortion. Um, also, because they're being half blocked out by the waves that are out there because of my angle that I'm filming from. There's another boat there that's all distorted, and it also looks like it's below the curvature, but that is not what's hiding it. It's that mirroring, that water mirror that's hiding it. Uh, like I said, um, there's going to be a few good examples here that have come into picture, and I'll try to explain what I see on those. wait for him to hit that visible water line okay I slowed this part down by 50% too just to show you that uh, you see this other wake and uh, this wake is going to be another boat that's out in front of this boat and uh, you, know, you can obviously see how that wake is kind of blocking out a little bit underneath that boat it's blocking out it's that the mirroring <coughs> excuse me um, so this uh, water plane, this hidden uh, mirror, this hidden water actually starts showing itself when it is uh, disturbed and raised up. Like I said, you can see how it's actually blocking out the bottom of this boat. Um, you see these birds pop up almost out of nowhere and fly away. Um, you see how it's blocking out the lower end of that boat? So imagine that boat from the side at a long distance and how much more would that block out? Um, you know, when you see these boats coming in from the front and you see this water wake that it's pushing out on each side of its boat and some boats push out different amounts of water um, and that that is what's hiding it when it's going across the my vision, my line of sight when it's going across, I can't see the lower end of the boat right there. There's a perfect example of why you can't because that water wake is actually hiding it. Um, if you measure the height of that, that's almost up to the edge of that boat. This is why, uh, too, when boats stop, some boats will sink down farther in the water than other boats. But, you know, you can obviously tell that these wakes are actually blocking out a lot of these boats when you see them out in the farther distance. Not only is it the waves from the water itself, but it is these wakes that the boats are actually putting out because you cannot see that water at a certain distance. Again, that water becomes invisible. It, it just it becomes like a big mirror. And this is why you cannot see the lower ends of boats. Think about a big ship and how much of a, a wake a big ship will actually put out. So take these things into consideration too. Put those under your belt. Um, 
You know, this flat earth stuff isn't uh, something that we all just decided to jump on the bandwagon and agree with. Now I'm back to normal speed on it and I'll let, uh, let the video speak for itself again. Um, I do talk in my videos, but sometimes I interrupt my audio so I can explain things or, you know, give you my opinion, you know, pick stuff out to where, you know, you can make sense of it. And I, I hope I do make sense for most of the people that watch my videos. Um, it's pretty obvious when you take into consideration the, the, the water actually turning into a mirror after the visible water line. And uh, this is what's hiding in all these boats is that water that you can't see doesn't allow you to see the lower ends of the boat. There he is. time lapse. And I'm going to go blurry, probably. Okay, I did uh, two 25-minute time lapses here and uh, wanted to see what was going to happen. And I did find out what was why I wasn't focusing back in when I zoom out, uh, zoom back in, and then zoom back out. Um, was because I didn't, I kept forgetting to set my camera to infinity. Um, but you'll see on these how, how these boats just uh, kind of go out there and zoom around, and, and you kind of see them blend in and 
you know, then they go off the screen. You don't get to see a whole lot because when you're doing a time lapse, you don't get uh, they will, it doesn't allow you to get full zoom and then set it on a time lapse. Um, don't ask me why it won't allow you to get a full full zoom. But if anybody can figure out how you can get a full zoom on it um, and put it on a time lapse, let me know. Um, even on stars, you don't get a full zoom because they don't. You know, when you go to a different setting, you can zoom in further on them. Um, but I just thought that these were really interesting. Thought I'd put them out there along with my video, and, and you know, even that boat right there, you can see how it, as as it went away, it got distorted, and it kind of started blending into the background. Okay, um, I did two of these, and uh, I uh, set the next one at a different angle. Um, actually, I did three, but the third one was uh, at a different height. And that'll come in the part three that I'll do. Uh, this is going to be a little shorter part. Um, I, I could have made the first video shorter, but um, I didn't. Um, simple as that. Uh, so you can see, you know, closer objects will block out farther objects. So you got to think about these waves that you can't see further out in the distance that's in the mirror. That mirror, that invisible water that you cannot see has waves to it, just like the waves that you see right here. And, you know, these waves at the angle that I'm, I'm filming, too, that angular resolution, it's not going to be able to pick up uh, a lot of detail at the bottom or even on the top of the boat. Um, but one of the things I find with my, when I lowered my camera down was, you'll see, um, um, I thought it was very interesting because I thought I'd see less distance, um, but that wasn't the fact. And you'll see that coming up in part three. All right. So again, I hope you enjoyed my presentation, my explanation of the plane, explaining the plane. Um, it's like an airplane flies on the plane. Uh, you know, it flies on the air plane. Okay. So there's that's also working the same way. All right. Like I said, I hope you enjoyed. Uh, share, like, subscribe. And use any parts of my videos that you'd like to. Um, I offer them for everybody. Uh, give me credit if you want. You don't have to. But I do appreciate it when people do give me my credit. Alright, thanks.